Hello, Indie Game Lover Slushy here. Today we're going to have a look at Tradewind. This is a student project from the DigiPen Academy, and I'm expecting this to be pretty good. From the screenshots, I could, from what I can gather, you're kind of a courier in a world that's dominated by airships and zephyrs, all those cool things. I've always been a big fan of that kind of aesthetic since Skies of Arcadia. My first impression is this main character looks like Naruto. But Naruto with a dead bird hanging out in front of him. Why does that bird not have animation? Just one more frame and it would have been cool, I guess. Maybe that will be explained to us. Maybe we have to revive the bird, who knows. Press X to accept the job. Okay. I pressed it. I didn't read what the job was. Okay, hold RT to whoosh. Oh yeah. So, what's our objective? Test out the Zephyr. Okay. Oh, that's what this rocket's called. Pretty cool. This reminds me of the Rocketeer from back in the 90s, but not so horrendous. That game was awful. So, have I, how far have I flown so far? 122 meters. Let's go for a spin. Let's see how far this baby will take us. I'm going to check the map. Now, where am I on the map? I'm not on the map. I am not on the map. Okay. That's pretty handy. I think it might have glitched out or something. Anyway. It's okay, we've, we've done it. We've got the right amount of meters. Here's the professor. Get in there. What the hell? Fantastic. She flies like a dream, which is good because we, we're officially broke. Now, now, don't worry. I have a plan. But first, we've got to get this old bird running proper again. Go see if you can find some help using the Zephyr. Okay. I'm out of here. I really like that mechanic. It's pretty fun. Just zipping around. Even with an objective. Let's see, we're gonna go find some help. So this place looks interesting. Who's this guy? Hey dude, I'm gonna take all your crates and just fuck off with them. Yeehaw! Okay. Uh let's stand here for a sec. Oh, we're back on the map. Okay, there we are. So let's go visit this old guy. I think he was about here somewhere, wasn't he? Okay. I'm gonna come down. Rocket Naruto! Fuck, get up there, get up, get up, get up. Here we go. At your service, buddy. Hey, Swift, could you pick up my lunch order from the butcher? No worries. Where the hell's the butcher? out the map again. The butcher is not visible or did I not accept the job? Follow your pet raven and retrieve Edgar's lunch from the butcher. Follow your pet raven, okay, maybe it's gonna point in the right direction. I'm trying to follow this dead bird. It's not really help oh, okay back this way. No, back that way. Okay, it must be down then. That's what I'm figuring, maybe not. Nope, back this way. I'm the winner! Yes! What's that? Looks like a scrunched up ball of paper. Or an anemic cabbage. What the fuck was that? The <laughs> anemic cabbage Olympics. I don't even know. So follow the dead bird. And the dead bird says this guy. Come on, bird. Stop giving me the fucking run around. Left or right? You said right before. Here we go. This guy looks like he's got some decent meat on him. Nope, he's a baker, maybe. This is the butcher for fucking sure. It's Sam the Butcher. Famous for taking Alice the meat. Edgar's order. I had it sent to the Trader Joe for a dash of his spices. Ah, oh, crap. Where's the trader? Where's this spice merchant at? Probably up here somewhere. I'm just guessing. Ah, oh, is the bird still pointing the way? Yep, he does. Okay. So, if the bird's such an integral part of the game, I wonder why they just didn't give him a second frame of animation. That's bugging me. It's really bugging me. Spice trader. 
Bird's pointing left, so it's got to be up this way. Ow. What do you got? Nope. I like your wares, though. Ah, uh, that looks spicy. Nope. It's Asian grocer or something? through the map. Okay. Maybe he'll just follow the right spot. It's a cafe or something, man. What's that? Uh, okay, guys. I might wrap this up in a sec. Considering I'm not having that much luck looking. Oh, you're a spice merchant? I never got a lunch order, but I did get an order of newly forged metals. Well, that's handy. The order's got switched. Follow your pet raven and retrieve the lunch order from the metallurgist. Metallurgist! Medellagist? Oh, I'm right. I'm riding a giant enemy cabbage, motherfucker. What are you doing? Red coat pussy. Ah, oh, come on. It has to be. I don't know where it has to be. I'm just talking shit. Could be anywhere. Yeah. Um, I may have accidentally misplaced... Ah, oh, here we go. Edgar's steak sandwich. Tell Edgar I'll requisition this top secret hammer design from the smithy instead. Really? The plan has changed. Take the order of the secret hammer design to the smithy. Where's the smithy? I really should have paid more attention. What, what looks like a smithy? Maybe right down the bottom. Come on. Come on, Naruto. Follow the dead raven. That isn't a smithy. Smithy! Nope. That looks like a smithy to me. Take the order off this. Okay, guys. I'm gonna pull out on this one. And, uh, yeah, I'm not going to say anything else. Say anything else, Seb. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this kind of random indie game preview. Stick around if you want to see more games from who knows where the fuck. Hope you enjoyed this. I'll catch you later. Where the fuck is the smith there? You lied. I went to the smithy. Nothing happened. Ugh. Bye, guys.